I could hop into medium right now. Boom, quick resume. Okay? Just like that. No, the, all, the only screen that you get is the splat, the first splash screen of whatever game that you're playing. You don't have to sit there and wait to see who developed the game, um, you know, who wrote the code. None of that. None of that. What it is, though, my people in these YouTube streets, it is your boy CJ the Taurus back again with another episode of Break Time on xCloud9. And today we're going to be getting into some uh, quick resume part two uh, video footage. So basically on my last video, I spoke to you guys about quick resume, the feature quick resume and how it works. Um, and basically after showing you guys that, I thought about it and I said, you know what? People don't truly know the full gist of quick resume because a lot of people don't have to use their Xbox in certain situations such as traveling or such as, um, you know, just transport, transporting an Xbox from one, you know, household to another household or something like that. You, you just, you know, some people don't have to move their Xbox from place to place. Um, so I figured why not show people how quick resume first one, how quick resume works. And then secondly, um, just how much or just how, you know, mobile quick resume is as well. So we're going to dive into that today, guys. Um, without further ado, let me go ahead and get this controller plugged in because I don't think I have any battery. I never did get um, a battery pack for this controller. So, all right, guys. All right, guys. So uh, I took the liberty of going ahead and starting a few games so that we could get right into this. So as I was doing this, guys, I really I was really marveling at the fact that I was even able to do this at all. Um, the fact that it's 2021, you know, I have a folding phone with a big enough screen to 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 um, you know make myself feel enough at home to play a game um, like like it's a TV screen to be honest and just have fun with it guys like the era that we're living in we're we're really blessed to see the technology and the things that we see on a day-to-day -day basis guys so instead of console warring guys to be honest I'm not making this video as a console war video yes it is a fact that these are things that PlayStation cannot do. So of course I state that fact in the videos, but I want you guys to know that I want the best for PlayStation. Hopefully PlayStation can like see some of this stuff and implement it themselves. I know it'll be a little bit tougher because their infrastructure is not made to, to um, you know, have that type of longevity as, as you know, the Xbox ecosystem does. And maybe, you know, PlayStation could be working on an ecosystem in the background that they could literally shoot to the PlayStation 5 that can make it do certain things so we don't know anything you know what's going on behind the scenes guys so you know with with all of that being said I want to go ahead and jump into the video now um, so basically this is how quick resume works let's say I was here and I was playing Assassin's Creed Valhalla as you can see right up here like I showed you in the last video at the t at the uh, right hand corner over there you saw that it came up as quick resume all right guys so as you guys can see, I am in Assassin's Creed right now. say for some reason I, I was thinking okay I don't really want to sit through this cutscene let's go to cyberpunk 2077 also you see the quick resume feature pop up right over there to the top right hand corner and hit resume crack it. Crack it. Guys, like I said, I'm truly amazed at the fact that I can even do this, okay? 
Come on. This come is, on. you know, this is next level stuff. And like I said, it's not perfect. You know, I, I said that in the last video as well. Um, you know, there is some input lag on this on this portion on the Xbox streaming your actual home console to your phone portion of this. There is still some lag. Let's move, let's go, uh, let's there's go. some latency. Some kind of um, game here. Game here. Shipping, code Shipping code on it. Code on it. Mm -hmm. I don't really want to try this, but I'm gonna go ahead and try it anyway. For this, for the sake of the stream, it's for you guys. Let me give it a, shot. Give it a shot. Okay. I did it for the sake of the stream. It's because of you guys that I actually got that correct. It's because of you guys, I promise. Cause I actually tried this before and I, I didn't get it. So help me scout. Help me bless up guys, bless up. Big blessings to you guys. Hang on, the sun is, oh, it don't work like that. Hang on, let me see. There it is. Hey, no more sun in my eye. Yeah, the sun was all in my eye. I know y'all saw that. Somebody's probably typing in the comment section. Yo, the sun is in your eye. All right, hang on, guys. We're going to go ahead and go to the next game here. No, that's not what we want. Okay. So we're in Cyberpunk, and we're like, okay, well, you know, maybe we want to, maybe we want to, you know, switch it up, and we want to do some gears. All right, so boom, we hit it quick resume right over there i'm telling you guys i could do this guy I, guys i could do this all day long from one gaming experience to another just like that now like i said this is a stream on my phone of course when you're doing this on the actual console i mean you're not seeing any of this you'll see some screen tearing on the screen um you'll see you know a few things like that this is not me streaming um, you, uh, this is not me streaming like an Elgato plug directly into my Xbox. This is me playing my Xbox from my phone. So I am sorry for the resolution of uh, the gameplay. But this is more of an, inf an, um, an educational video just to show some people who may be waiting on their Xbox Series X or Series S. Um, you know, to be able to purchase one or to some people who may be PlayStation uh, fans that don't have an Xbox at all and just don't know anybody who can show them these things. You know, I just want to, you know, get this information out there so that you guys can see the differences between all of these consoles. Um, and, you know, just this, even the, I, I want you guys to see the evolution from the Xbox one to the Xbox series because the Xbox one it's like the PS5. It can't do any of these things either. And I don't mean that as a knock to the PS5. I mean that this was just something that was a next gen feature for Xbox. They felt like this was a feature that they needed. And I feel like it is, you know, definitely, definitely a welcome feature. I mean, come on. I could hop into medium right now. Boom. Quick resume. Okay. Just like that. No, the all, the only screen that you get is the splat, the first splash screen of whatever game that you're playing. You don't have to sit there and wait to see who developed the game, um, you know, who wrote the code. None of that. None of that. You get straight into gameplay, and that's what I really like about this. Um, now, before I end this video, for all of those who have stuck around to the end of the video, thank you so much. I really do appreciate it. Um, please like, subscribe, share this out with a friend or two if they don't know about this information. This is stuff that people should know so that they can make the best decision when they're going out and spending $300, uh, you know, $300 to $500, depending on which console you're getting. Um, <clears throat> so, you know, this is something that I feel like is important. So share this out, guys, seriously. If not even for me at this point, seriously, I feel like this is information that people should know before they go out and spend their hard earned money. Anyway, last but not least, this is what I wanted to tell you guys about the most, okay? So, 
when I travel to Las Vegas, Nevada, I will be posting a video about that shortly. We stayed at the Aria Hotel. That hotel was awesome. Um, we did like a little hotel uh, room, you know, uh, MTV crib style thing. You know, I'm, I'm just going to put it on there. It's just something fun, guys. But, uh, you know, when I went there, of course, I took my Xbox Series S with me because it's so small and compact and, and you can travel with it. You know, um, it's very, very, you know, portable. So, you know, I took that with me. Once I got to the hotel, um, you know, I plugged it in. And I noticed immediately that all of these games that I haven't saved for a quick resume. So every single one of these games I just showed you that I was playing that I had on quick resume, all of them quick resume at the same exact places that they were when I was here in Florida. I, t I went all the way to Las Vegas and still all of these games were saved in quick resume. Guys, that is something that I can't stress enough how fire that is. As long as the game is saved in quick resume, it doesn't matter if the Xbox turns all the way off. If you restart the Xbox, boot it up. If you haven't played the Xbox in three to four months, it doesn't matter. When you get back on that Xbox, every single game that you go to, Assassin's Creed, Assassin's Creed, Assassin's Creed, boom, quick resume. You see what I'm saying? If I would have clicked on Gears 5, if I would have clicked on Gears 5, boom, quick resume. We're right back where we left off, guys. That's all I have to say for this episode. Just remember, guys, everything, the best things in life are green, guys. I'll catch you guys in the next episode. This is a great one. Take it easy. Peace. Get up, Olaf. Stay lucid, friend. My sword is grown greedy. I'm ready to fight. So nice having all of these hearty folk in our home. Drink in your fist? Come on, I'll find you something. I can't. I have a tribute for your father. Oh, what a piece. That must be worth two sturdy long chips. Give it here. I'll pass it on. My father asked me, Sigurd. Suit yourself. But you're not getting any mead. Like a Seder works through my hammer. <laughs> Speak with the king. Hold it up to the light. Show him the fine details. See there? I etched his name in runes on the outer band. You'll show him? Mm -hmm. You are just like your father, little berserker. Skull to you. Skull! You see? She agrees. <laughs> Have the ring? Good. This was worn by your grandfather in a battle on the Northern Way. Mother? Yes. Can we show Sigurd the can stones his dad yesterday? That's a good idea. We'll do that in the morning. The first light.